you would have told me four years ago from this day, you would be sitting here giving a toast to Katie Stack the day before your wedding in New Orleans at her parents' house, I would have said, yeah, in my dreams. It was perfect. That's such a good He's word. so cute. So Katie, life with you has been an absolute dream. I love you more than anything in the entire world. I want to ask everyone to raise their glass to an awesome day tomorrow, but most importantly, my bride, Katie Steck. <laughs> Katie, you're special. You have been all, always. If you're at all friend, you know what I mean. If you just met her, you know what I mean. Um, you have a wonderful way of connecting with people quickly, genuinely, in a deep way, and it lasts. He's an undeniably odd cat, right? <laughs> no grown adult has an excuse to be as obsessed with Disney as he is. It would be something along the lines of, oh, Britt, you know what you would really like to have with this DCOM? That's Disney Channel original movie, for those of you who don't know. I, would, I think we would really want to have cookies. You know, that would be so good. Why don't you go bake some for us, Britt? And I just, I couldn't deny it. He was right. I wanted cookies. And, and he's like, I just went to the, the grocery. I've got fresh milk. Like, we can, dip, we can dip the cookies in the milk. It's going to be great. Katie is full of energy. She rarely wakes up without a smile on her face and is without a doubt one of the very best people I have ever met. He's, uh, he's inclusive, he, he pulls people together. I think one of Alex's best characteristics is he's got a big and a kind heart. Katie, I love you so much. I'm so proud of you. I can't believe you're getting married. It seems like yesterday we were filming Vicky Vu, watching, <laughs> watching the OC and wrestling with William. Marriage is a partnership you have to work at every day. You will have disagreements, but never go to bed mad. Never text like the generation you're part of. Always talk it out. Always respect each other. Always continue to date each other. And finally, always remember the importance of a family. You're without a doubt my best friend I will ever have. Don't tell Iko. <laughs> I was worried I would never be completely and utterly in love with somebody. And then you danced your way into my life at Grits. And I am so thankful for that night. Free riding jitters, I haven't had a single one that involved any doubt that I have found my soulmate and I will be with you from now until I am no longer on this earth. I knew from our first date on June 27, 2017. I know with 100% certainty that God intended us to be together. I know soulmates are real because of you. So funny. It was perfect. That's such a good He's player. so cute. This is a picture of our first like text after our date. And then he printed out, he messaged me on Facebook in 2009 and printed it out. <laughs> I think it was the first weekend, the first weekend you moved back to New Orleans. You said, dude, you'll never guess who I was talking to at Grits last night. Katie Steck. But I knew when you told me that, just knowing both y'all, kind of your quirky personalities, that something was gonna, was gonna fit. Having known you both since childhood, independently and as a couple, it's clear to me that you fit like two pieces of a puzzle. And I can't wait to see you two tie the knot tomorrow. But then you try and reconcile that with this other side of the guy, right? Like, if I get one more 3 a.m. Snapchat 
of him singing, screaming Blink-182, just drenched in sweat. And we're in New Orleans for Katie's birthday. Alex is like patiently waiting for his Blink-182 song to come on so he could get up on stage and sing it. And he gets up there and he puts on this huge performance, has the whole bar involved, just like belting it out. And I look over and Katie is like front and center, hands in the air, biggest smile on her face. I'm like, oh my gosh, this is it. They're perfect for each other. He makes her so happy. Welcome to the family tomorrow. Um, we are um, so happy you're going to be our son-in-law. Meeting you and um, uh, getting to know you over the last, last two years, uh, we really like you a whole lot. All of us do. <laughs> As everyone knows in this room, Katie brings out the joy in people. She is proof that the best way to live life is through love and laughter. Alex, welcome to the family. You're truly a stand-up guy, and I'm proud to call you my brother. I see how happy you make my sister, and I couldn't ask for anything more. It makes me so happy that Katie has found the perfect man to spend the rest of her life with. From the start, Katie and Alex were the perfect complement to each other, and I'm so happy for you both and can't wait for you to get married tomorrow. Cheers to Katie and Alex. <laughs> Make her real. Yay. Oh, that's perfect. You like it. I love it. <laughs> I love you. Oh, love you too. <laughs> Look at you. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's perfect. Standing here amongst your youngsters, and I'm so uh, excited about Alex and Katie. I think it's great for them to start off their lives together in this great city of ours with a lot of great friends like you. As the years give way to years, remember that your promises tonight are unconditional. You'll both make mistakes, but that doesn't change the promises you make tonight. And my hope for you is that your home will be filled with laughter and with lots of friends and with all the love you can possibly imagine today. Katie, I give myself to you this day. And promise to love and cherish you. And promise to love and cherish you. Alex, I give myself to you this day. And promise to love and cherish you. And promise to love and cherish you. To support and comfort you. To support and comfort you. To 
honor and keep faith with you. To honor and keep faith with you. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. He is the most indecisive individual I've ever met in my life. And with, with his proposal to Katie, there was not even a second of doubt. It was just a call, and it was, hey, if you're not in town on this date, like, we're going to have a problem. <laughs> you know, no question, no hesitation. They go together better than most. I love y'all so much. Raise your glass for toast. You two are so much alike in so many different ways. Y'all make a wonderful pair. We wish you the best in your marriage. So excited and I love y'all so much. The sweetest girl in the world met the sweetest young man. Katie, I am so happy you are marrying my brother. As much as I make fun of him, I absolutely adore him. And you are really just the blessing I've been praying for for him all these years. Look forward to, the, to their life journey of good times, fun times, and uh, just happiness. Looking forward to being there with you every step of the way, watching you grow together and grow your family together. I raise a toast to you, Katie and Alex. Cheers. Katie and Alex, and as they say in the maritime field, may you always have fair weather and falling winds. All the best. We love you. Here, here. We're so proud of both of you. We want to support you forever. Um, uh, we love you. Uh, I raise a toast to the both of you, to Katie and Alex for a long, happy, loving life. I therefore declare that they are married. You may kiss. <laughs> I'm not gonna let you go